Good morning, guys. <coughs> Welcome. Welcome to another Instagram workout live. Hi. Ready to get a quick workout done? Happy Friday. I know it's Easter weekend in the US. Also in Brazil, it's Easter weekend. So, exciting weekend coming along. And the best way to start is just uh, getting a good workout done. Good morning. Thank you. You look fit. That's the goal, right? Let me know where, where are you from. I'm, I am in New Jersey, guys. As you know, if you're new to my Instagram, welcome. Let me just lower the music real quick. Let me just do a quick intro. If you are new to my channel, welcome. My name is Grace Levine. I am a health coach and I do an Instagram live every Friday at 7 a.m. It's usually, right now it's a heat workout using just body weight. So anybody that's looking to get a workout done, you're more than welcome to join me. Okay, so build to, to be fit from Dallas, Texas. Nice. That's awesome. I'll just wait like a couple of more seconds until uh, some other people join us. But if you are doing this workout with me right now, just make sure you are wearing some uh, comfortable shoes. Have a, a mat, it would be great. And also a bottle of water because we're gonna be doing heat and that's gonna bring your heart rate up. And you're gonna get like a little thirsty. So make sure you have water around. Okay, it's very important, stay hydrated. Okay, so it's 7.04. I think we can just start warming up before we start the workout. So let's just start by opening up the chest here. Open, close. Body. Okay. Now it's good to do a quick warm up whenever you're gonna work out. You don't like a two minute one.
of jump jacks, okay? So we're gonna be doing 50 just to get everything going. So when you're, again, when you're doing your jump jacks, jumping jacks, just uh, make sure you're using your whole body, okay? Not just doing this, all right? So if you're going to, if possible, do a little clap and then come back, okay? And keep breathing. So we're gonna do 50 together just to warm up the workout for the day, all right? Ready? All right, let's go. I'll be counting. So one, two, three, going. One, two, three, four, five. We just lower this music a little bit. So uh, we did this. I did this whole thing again another Friday, but it's ba basically part one of the workout. We're gonna be doing power knee, Russian twist, and plank taps. So just one second. Okay, so let me just show you the power knee. Power knee, it's basically you're gonna keep your weight in one leg. Let's see, take care of that part. So choose one leg to start with, okay? So let's say I'm starting with the left leg. I'm keeping, I'm engaging my core here. As you can see, you see the weight is here. So I'm engaging everything here. And then I'm going to use my arms to create some momentum and then pull, okay? So that's exactly what we're gonna do. It's hard in the beginning because you need to find the right balance here. Then just pull. So we're gonna do 10 for each leg, okay? So we do everything for one leg. One, two, three, and then everything for the other leg. Make sure you're engaging, okay? Everything here, so engaging your car. Very important to engage, okay? Remember to engage your car, and then you go, okay? One, two, everything is working, all right? That's exercise number one. The number two exercise is gonna be Russian twist. If you have, if you have any dumbbell at home or any type of weight, you can use it. If you don't have, just do it out the way, okay? So the number two exercise is going to be uh, the Russian twist. So you can, if you are super beginner to working out, just keep your feet like that, okay? And just twist here with the weight, like this. Touch the forward here, and then go back, look into the way. Okay, we're twisting the whole core over here. Okay, that's the goal. Now, if you're a little bit more advanced and your car is a little bit stronger, you can lift your feet, engage the car here, and then you go. Okay, and breathe. Control all the weights here. Alright, but if you're a beginner, just 
Even you can do with no weights, just do with your head like that. And still you're gonna feel, I'm still feeling. Alright, so you can just do that. One, two, three. This is the Russian twist. And then exercise number three is going to be plank ten. Dumbbell pads. Pads. So again, you can use a dumbbell to tap. If you don't have a dumbbell, just use whatever. It can be like a water bottle or something. Okay? So you're gonna be in a plank position. Holding a plank. Okay, so when you're here, engage your core. Alright? Engage your core. And then you do a little tap. One, two, everything, when I'm moving my hands here, everything is forming around here, okay? That's the goal, do the exercise, right? One, two, all right? This, I think for this three exercise, it's just good to focus on doing it right, okay? The part two of the exercise, we can do a little faster, more power, but this one, just do it low and do right, okay? Try to always be engaging your core, all right? That's the most important thing, do it right. So, I'm gonna start. Have some water if you need. And we're gonna start. Just follow along. We're gonna do three sets for everything and then move on to part two. All right? So starting with power knee in one second. Let me just start my Apple Watch. Okay. All right, we're going. Start with the power knee. Okay. Ten each leg. Ready? I'm starting with this. Weight on the left.
Okay. So back to the knee, the power knee. Ready? Start to move with this leg. Again. We're doing ten. One, two, three. Going. Right here. One, two, three.
part one of the workout is not much about intensity. It's more about core, because you, you could feel we were, we were using our core the whole time. So now we're gonna do part two. And part two is gonna have intensity, okay? We're gonna be doing more jumping and moving the full body. So that should be bring your heart rate up uh, and down, okay? So drink some water, because they're gonna need it. Okay. All right, let me show you. So part two, as always, we're doing three exercises three times, okay? And then this part two is more intensity. So um, we're gonna start with this squat, oblique knee. So basically, you're squatting right here, but down, keep the chest high, okay? That's proper way to do this squat. Chest to high like that, and then the butt goes down, and it comes up, okay? That's how you do it. So we're doing a squat oblique knee. So what we're gonna do, do this squat, and do that, okay? Bring the knee up to your elbow, kind of. And then go back, bump. Go back, up, okay? Go back, and bring. So we're going, we're doing 20 total, all right? Then after that, we're doing push-ups. I know, we gotta do push-ups, like, every single week. Push-ups so good, you gotta try to do it. If you don't know how to do the full push-up, start with your knee on your knee. Okay, like that. I mean, I started like that because I couldn't do one a few years ago. I couldn't do one. You might need the mat because it hurts to be on the floor. So, knee here, right? You're driving your chest to the floor. So, driving your chest to the floor. If you're new, and then you pull. Okay? Just saying, so okay, my chest is going to the floor. Now I gotta come back up together with my whole body. So, you just do a power one. If you can't do that, just do this, okay? One. All right, and if you do, if you can do the full push up, I'm gonna be doing the full. Then it's just push up with your feet straight like that, okay? And then one, two, three, okay? We're only doing ten. Ten push ups, and after the push ups, it's gonna be the burpees. Why? Because Burpees are amazing. We need to always be doing the burpees. Or it's full body. That's how I get a little bit of definition in my abs here. When I do squats with the weight, so I'm like using the weights to come up and then using my core all the time. And also burpees. Burpees are amazing. Like you gotta be doing burpees. If you want to be more athletic, more feet, you gotta love burpees, okay? All right, so the burpees are going to be, you bring, you know, you bring all your, you bring your body to the floor, kick it back, and then you bring everything up and do a little jump if you can, okay? So you're working the full body, it's amazing. So again, like that, let me just keep, get down, back and go. Okay, that's we're gonna be doing 10. So yeah, part two of the workout is gonna be in your hands, but that's the goal. Alright? Let's go.
on something efficient, right? I drink some water. All right, I'm going to close this. Now, that was intense. Oh, wow, my heart rate got up to 174. It's probably because of the burpees. Because this is really good for my heart. I love it. So I hope you guys got this high intensity hit as well. Because this is key to be burning body fat for the next 48 hours. Right? When you get this speak of high intensity and then you slow down and you go again, that's what's happening. I love it. I love it. So thanks for joining me. Drink some water. If you can. I'm doing a little pull down here just because I like to do a little bit stretch after this. And uh, I'll just change the mood, the music, and um, and you can do with me. Alright, but if, if I if you need to leave because you gotta go to work, I just wanna thank you for joining. And these light workouts is always safe. These, uh, all my live workouts from Instagram, I was, are saved um, on my feed and I also post them on YouTube and Facebook, on my page on Facebook and YouTube, so if you don't like to watch long videos on Instagram, like I don't, uh, go to YouTube, okay, follow me on YouTube, subscribe to my channel and you can see the whole video there, or you can connect to your TV and see in a bigger screen. Uh, another thing is that I'm hosting a master class on Thursday where I'm gonna be sharing uh, with you five healthy secrets to get fit and stay fit as a lifestyle. So if you are looking to change your lifestyle, regard, uh, your food habits, your, your uh, exercising habits, if you're sedentary and you want to change, but you don't want to do anything crazy, anything insane, anything um, that was going to make you just starve to lose weight or something like that, just uh, sign up to my master class because I'm going to be sharing these five secrets that's all about lifestyle, all right? It has been working for me for years and works for my clients as well, so I just want to share with you guys and really... I really believe this masterclass will give you everything you need to change your lifestyle and get the results that you want, all right? And keep it that way, because that's the most important thing, keeping it, all right? Okay, so I'm just gonna put in like a slow, slow uh, music here and do a little bit stretch and have a beautiful day, have a beautiful Easter, enjoy your weekend. All right, let me go find a relaxing song here. Uh, okay, relax. All right. All right, let's go.
again. Oh. 
dumb. <laughs> Uh, 